y'all welcome back to fly after 50 it's me d and i'm here with my final sephora vib sale haul for spring <laughs> that was a long sentence so if you want to see the last final things i got just keep on watching okay if you did not see my initial haul click on Click up here or click on the link down in the description box so you can see the, the initial haul. But this is the last things I got. And these, these, most of these purchases are based on the stuff I saw y'all buy. So, it's your fault. And because of this, I'm officially on a no buy as of today. It's the second. It should have been the first, but um, I had to get something real quick. <laughs> <laughs> As of today, I'm on a no buy and I won't be buying nothing until the holiday releases for like for Christmas start coming out. So pray for me, y'all. Let's get back get to what I got. Okay, the first thing I got, okay, this is not from Sephora, but it's I purchased it because the one I wanted from Sephora was out of stock so i got the dominate uh-uh i don't know who i'm playing with i don't know who i'm playing with let me put my glasses on shopping 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 all right y'all okay so like i said this purchase was based on an item that i wanted from sephora that was out of stock which was the huda beauty uh pink, the pink powder it was out of stock which I have since bought it, but I had to buy it on full price. But anyway, this is the Dominique Cosmetics Smooth and Blur Setting Powder. This is what it looks like. And it's the color is Rosita Brightening Pink. So it's a nice, I don't know if you can tell, but it's, you can see it has a mauve top. with a gray undertone, actually. And it is pink probably can't see that so they say this is really good for brightening under your eyes the pink the pink tone another thing I got was for I got two things from LYS the first thing I got is their translucent setting powder uh, I got this one in banana because I don't really have any yellow setting powder so you know comes in this standard packaging and it's yellow also from them i have their uh no limits cream bronzer stick and strength which is the dark one but mine came like it seemed like it is it is I ain't playing about this packaging. Here's what it looks like. Very cute, the triangle. But mine is sticking out a little bit. It don't look like it was used or anything, but it's sticking out. So I'll be using this one. And I'm pretty sure there's one color darker than this. All right, another thing I got. Oh, everybody and their mama see Mike was talking about this Givenchy Prisme. Libre Skin Caring Concealer. So I got this in Warm 430. It's supposed to be a skin tone color. So I got, ooh, I got so many concealers. Oh Lord. So I got this to give a try. Concealer. Another thing I got which was not, which was because of people's VIB recommendations, but I got it from Macy's. This is the Giorgio Armani Neo Nude Melting Color Balm in the color, it's a blush, it's a cream brush, blush in the color 30, because they don't even sell the cream bronzers at Sephora. But uh, I Am Kaya was talking about this, so I was like, oh, let me give it a try. It's very cute very cute and let me see 
there's the blush it's an orangey blush it is small and you so you get 3.5 grams 0.12 ounces I'm not sure what a normal cream blush is but it is beautiful and the packaging is nice so to go along with that I got the uh, luminous silk glow blush also in 30 same packaging and let me see look like the same weight as well so this one's black so it has a little jeep on she's thing on here that I can't figure out with this and this is the this is the color so my first Givenchy blushes all right the, these three things here I also got from the Sephora collection their uh, shower oil I saw a little cute nurse talking about her this and me and her have the same issue uh, about being lazy and being not lazy not wanting to have to put on a lot of lotion, but I have to because my husband called me ashy. He called me ashy one time and I done bought every single skin product for ashiness since. He gonna rue the day he's to, he called me ashy that one time. Anyway. They had three different ones. They were the, for nine bucks and you get 6.76 fluid ounces. Manoy. It says Manoy and Hot Sand, the most unforgettable summer come rushing back. This one is Argon. It says, feel the warmth of soothing Argon notes that pamper body and mind. And the last one is Coconut. An invitation to a sweet escape. The coconut's fragrance is pure bliss. So, hopefully, they'll keep the ash away and have me smelling good. Speaking of smelling good. I saw some people talking about this Sol de Janeiro by Rio Radiance. That this is the scent for the summer or it has a summer scent. So, I want to give it a try. It says a solar scent that combines clean white florals, creamy coconut milk, and the warmth of sun on the sand. So, can't always see it because it's on a clear background. So that's that. Ooh, what else, what else, what else? Okay, I also got, this is something else people were talking about. The Power Sculpt Velvet Bronzer by House Labs. So I got mine in deep level 11. Okay. So this is the packaging. It's like a bronze packaging versus her silver. So it looks on the back. Very nice. And this is rubber. Okay, cool. Okay, I like that. So that's the House Labs bronzer. I also got from House Labs because I got a blush the last time. I got another blush. And this is the Dragon Fruit Days. I have the water. I already have the watermelon one. So I want this pinky one for the summer. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Standard silver packaging. Yeah. That's beautiful. That's Dragon Fruit Days. What else I got in here? Um, Blush, I got the Say Do Blush, the Liquid Cheek Flush in Dreamy. I do not need any more blushes either. Oh, that's pretty. That's what that looks like. That's another thing I don't need. I, 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 did, I just need a break. Speaking of blushes, I also have the, uh, I bought one more. Now, this makes four. The Nessa Myricks Beauty Yummy Skin Flushed Blurring Balm Powder. I have it in Rose and Brunch. Let's take 
this plastic off. There were so many blushes and good blushes and good reviewed um, bronzers that came out. I, I just couldn't resist. And Lord, don't get me started on foundation. I got another one in here. So that's what that looks like. Open this one. Oh, that's pretty. That is pretty. Okay, I'm I'm good on. I'm not buying another blush. No more blush. My finger here. Not one more blush. Okay. What else I got in here? Hold up, y'all. Hold up. Oh, oh. Also from um, House Labs, I got one of her. Le Monster Lip Crayons. I got the Peach Matte. These are so cute. And I haven't worn it yet, but I have another one. It feels so good on the skin. And so that's what that one looks like. Because Peachy Nudes are my favorite. I remember telling y'all remember me telling y'all. Oh no. Y'all remember me telling y'all that, right? Peach Nudes are my favorite. So I'm going to give this a try. It's so cute. So cute. All right, let's continue on one. Okay, I got one more thing uh, for lips. Lip liner. I got this multi-liner from Tower 28. So, I wonder why it says multi-liner. I think maybe because it's good that you can use it any on your eyes and your lips. Do not quote me on that. But why call it multi-liner? Like multi-use liner. But this one is a brown. In, I guess the colors draw me. So that's what it looks like. Some people were saying they, they have good lip liners. Nice and smooth. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Let's see what else, what else you got, girl? Oh, I got the Bobbi Brown Skin Corrector Stick in Very Deep Peach. I got this, who was it? Victoria, Victoria. I always forget her last name. But anyway, I always forget, but she has a Lux channel. But she said this was good, not only under your under your foundation, but on top of your foundation. So, I got this. Give that a try. Oh, 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 oh. I also got the Glow, <laughs> the glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Niaminicide Dew Drops. I got the mini. And it says for ultimate glow and brightening. So I got the mini because I do plan on like, because now I did see this on a video somewhere. Oh, isn't it so cute? Where they were putting, somebody was putting on their concealer, right? But they they mixed it with, with the glow serum for under their eyes. So I'm thinking that'll help me get more moisture under my eye. And I started doing that with, hang on. They don't, I didn't see this. For sale anymore i would have bought another one but i got this 24 hour concealer from estee lauder that has a hydro prep on the end i used to just put the hydro prep on let it let it dry and then put this on now i started mixing it together and i really like it so that's what i'll be doing with this with other concealers all right i'm, I'm almost done they put a lot of paper in this one okay 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 i did get a foundation and concealer I tried to resist, but I ended up getting the Valentino, very Valentino, light lasting perfecting foundation and the all day light lasting covering concealer. Okay, so let's look. I got the foundation in DN2. I think that means deep neutral too. So that's the foundation. It does have, have SPF in it. It has SPF 26. 
And I got the concealer in deep neutral one. So that's cute. So I got that. All right. And let me see. Okay, the last thing I have is Dolce Perfume. It's by Rosie Jane. And I have this in the scent. What scent is it? Is it Dolce? Oh, wait a minute. I think that is the scent. Dolce is the scent. Oh, is that cute? This is what it looks like. And it's a clean formula. It says, why do I put it on such light? It's vanilla, hanoki wood, nude musk. Feels like a long, feels like long kisses, mixtapes, and sweet dreams. Okay. I like that. All right, so that's all I have. This is everything I got for the Sephora VIB spring sale. No more shopping for me. I'm, I'm laying low for a couple of months. And that is why I'm not really going to be on social media. Because these eyes see it. I got to get it. I am a FOMO shopper. If I see you liking it, I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to like it too. And I'm going to want it. So that's why I'm not looking at videos right now. But um, yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you're having a great day. I appreciate all of you. And I will see you in another video.